Oh god, so I'm just gonna heave him to his fun and we grab this tree. Oops, nope. If I'm not, I should be paying more oh. attention. Right, uh, no. Let's just take this tree. Try it back down here. Oh, hello there. This first Swedish woman is like, what the fuck is this asshole up to? Right, where is my hired worker? He's way down there. Uh, where's these trees? There they are. Hey, dude. Don't mind me. Now, I wanted... Another... Tractor for something. I can't remember what I wanted it for now. Right, let's drag you. Somewhere you're not, but I'll just drag them right up to the other trees. And I'll just dump all the trees in the same place. So I can wood chip them easier. Right, what's up with you, pal? You can no longer recognise the fields. Okay. Well, that's a simple enough eh, problem to fix. Three, two. Is that a telephone? Alright, so take over your thing. Ah, oh, that's another tree I missed because it's still standing. Bugger logs didn't actually manage to knock it down. And his quest for destroying every single living creature on the planet. Oops. Wait, remember I have to back up a trailer, Stuart? I've been watching these AIs back up trailers too long. Just drag it behind you. That's it. I am trying to see where I'm driving here, game. Oh fucking hell! Stop zooming in! That's it. Drop it. That's a good little tractor. So I'll finish that field off by myself because, yeah, the course play driver, well, the hired worker is just so intelligent. Mm -hmm. I see that as a bounce of boom arm of the chipper off my heat. Right, no, 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 yes, yes. Picky uppy, picky uppy, picky uppy. That's it. I hate when it zooms in like that. And there's no fucking need for it to zoom in. It's like it's miscalculating the hitbox of the tree and just saying, oh god, you're inside the tree now. 
Let's be D. Let's hope he has more luck getting into farm sim this time. Hello BP, you made, a, you made an appearance on Thursday's episode. I think this is Thursday's episode. Possibly it's Thursday's, Thursday's episode. Oh well. Yeah, we'll put the boom arm away like it's supposed to. Close it up. Spin it round. Put it down. All nice and neatly folded. Yes, there we go. What the fucking hell? Is that camera on the actual? Let's try that again. Is there a camera on my... Is that a camera on the actual... Huh. Well, I'm using him there later, so I'm going to leave him there. And we're going to carry on this evening for Bob Ag here. V is generally the lower button. I'm not too worried about driving straight. Just long to cover the whole field. I'll just leave it running the globe of the road as well, like I'm seeking the whole road with grass. time doing this because it's such an angle for it. But hopefully the other guy does because he's got a gun with force play. Oh, so he should be able to just like drive where he wants to. Pokemon, you guys see the all. Ha ha ha. Right. This last little bit he missed, and that's a deal done. We now have enough grass to feed our sheep. They only seem to be using like a thousand, two thousand for a fifty sheep. I should be easily able to make that from this field. Let's go drop him back off where he was. I should be in the cab thing there. Yeah, like. Oh, watch out! Never mind. Brutal murder in Sweden. <laughs> That's another one for the wood chipper. <laughs> oh my fucking god! That's what we'd get redwood. Oh my god, so sick. 
fucking me though. Is it in a barn to store shit in? Have we got enough of them already? Looks like a dog, but I said to them, they're looking for her. Let's see what she's up to. Have I not folded this? Oh! Oops. Earlier. Oopsies. Well, at least the sea hitters now look a bit more worn and used. Just drive right over this crop field. Ouch. Ouch. Ow. Uh, I'll forgive the one at this canola here, truck here. It's got the Flegel trailer. Flegel trailer. Yeah, because the canola is much less yield for per farm. Hectic. 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 It's much less yield. So it won't need as big a trailer to get it all. So you can go longer on a 45,000 trailer than the Weak can on the 60,000 trailer. Yeah, yeah. It'll be dirty soon enough though. Don't worry, this gleaming, shining piece of shit will soon be covered in shit. That's we got four trucks now as well. Five actually, include the Tatra. And four fertilizers. <laughs> Two, three, four cedars. Five harvesters. And just one. What you call it? Harvester for chaff. <laughs> I only need the one for the chaff though. Because so I'll be doing that after. I need two trucks to like take the chaff down to the. What you call it? BG silo, biogas plant. That's it. What the fuck? Doug. Sleep! Oh, bloody duck! She's going back on this computer desk into the bench and the bed there, she doesn't stop it. Right, so, what to do now? We have seeded this field. <sighs> Sorry, it has been seeded now, but I can't do anything with it until it grows. Which it's just started doing. We can have her just jump in and see how the tractor handles, of course. Well, yes, it picks up. Okay. I mean, there's nothing much to pick up just now because the grass is not growing. It's only the stuff around the head edges of the field that are grown. But. Oh yes, it's getting all this stuff as well. Turns around. And oh my god, that turned in circle. But that's not that big a deal. As long as it collects enough grass every day to Raise more. Left pickup. Turn off forage wagon. Hang on, as a forage wagon. Alright, that's what it's called here. Anyway. Yeah, so that works. So that's okay. 
the turning circle is a bit too tight for this track there, but it will do the job. And it will have grass to put into the sheep wheels to let them feed the water. Hi. Hi. And that's been about an hour and a half since I got the sheep up to 200. And I had 6,000 to start with, so... 200... Food in an hour and a half. No, 150 food. Yeah, about 150 food in an hour and a half. So that's 100 food an hour. That's like 2,000 foods a day. Yeah, 2,500 food a day. Doug! Yeah, two and a half thousand food a day, and that gives me three percent. That's like two percent an hour. That would mean I would get half a fucking pallet a day. On two hundred sheep, half a pallet a day on two hundred sheep. That is fucking slow as shit. Two thousand food a day though. I can easily, easily feed them 2,000 food a day. Do you think I should just go whole hog and just bump it right up to... Yeah, just bump it right up to the max. Or whatever. I'll put 400 sheep in my field. That'll be a pallet a day, uh, about 5,000 food a day. I can easily, easily handle that. If my math is right. I'll tell you what, I'll leave it until the end of the record session. So another half hour, that should be another 1% on uh, that. So that's like 250 wool it's gotten in an hour and a half. So it should get another. Hundred and seventy per da, 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 da. What should I eat another bit sixty? Woo. Eighty wool? Eight wool, yeah. Should give another bit eighty wool there and it should have used up another I said about hundred and fifty woo food have used, so now fifty food should have gone. Yeah, let's have a look at that. If that's if my numbers are right and it's only about two and a half thousand food a day for two hundred, I'll bump it right up to four hundred sheep. And that'll get me a pallet a day. Yay! And that means I only need to wait fourteen days to fill up this trailer. Well, eleven because I've already got three pallets on it. And you can get fourteen pallets per trailer. If you pack them on right. Yay! So, two fuel weeks to fill up that trailer. And there's two thousand per pallet, and the prices are. per wheel, 1.2 per pallet. So, one and a fifth, a fifth is 400. So, 2,400 per pallet. Times by 14 is like. 24 grand, and another four is. 96 so about 3,434 grand 34 grand for every two weeks for these 400 sheep and I barely have to do anything for them it's not the fucking greatest yield in the world but hey money is money anyway with that note I'll leave you this episode for the day just watching these sheep Munch away at this grass. And if I could bump up to 400, though, that'll be like a trough a day, which is the same as the cows are at. So 50 cows and 400 sheep is what you need to just feed them once a day. That's a good thing to note. And I'm just like jumping up these buildings out here. Hey, sheepy, sheepy, sheepies! Okay, so anyway, I'll check at the end of the ne next episode if. That's my number of correct. So, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.